and welcome back to Brick Cat. Today we're looking at my vending machine I've created here. So this is using the Lego Mindstorm system and you can have a look inside here. So the idea is you've got two chutes on either side where you get your bricks and then you've got an uh, insert here where you put your money in. So here's the code. So what you have to do is get five peas, it only accepts five peas. You try any other money, it just does not fit in the gap. It's either too big to fit in this gap here, or it's too wide to fit through the slider. So quickly, if I go put that in, you can hear a sound. So that means that you can choose if you want the right side, which dispenses bigger pieces, and the left side, smaller pieces. So we're up to the hub, and I'll choose the left side. I'll press the button, and out come some of the smaller pieces. Here, yeah, there's a few more. There we go. So it gives you around 15 pieces each time. And then I can choose to put another coin in over here and choose the right side and a few of the bigger pieces come out. A few less this time because a few less this time because they're a bit bigger. So I can show you the inside and how this works. So inside we have a locking lid so now you can't take it off but you slide it back and lift and this is the inside. You don't understand how long this took to create. So, we've got the two chutes where you fill up these guys. This where you fill up these guys. Some of them. Quite dark. And then you've got two motors. This one, you can try and look inside here. see in there there's a, there's a brick with teeth so it can slide back as a little tray in there can slide back and forward to let things into the shoes see there so look, that's the tray it's moved back and forward on those sliders and then you've got the same on the other side and then for protecting the money we've got got a light sensor I'll open it up so you get the money out to get a rod put it in this hole and then grip it and you can take it out to access the money in there which goes in this little area and there's the light sensor so it detects the money falling down into the tray so that's, basic, that's the basic idea if you want to build one of these you need a hub to choose if, which one you want and work out all the stuff. You need a way to put the money in and sort the money. So this, there's this little thing here that only, you can adjust it so only a 5p can fit through the gap. And a pound or, or any currency you use can't fit through. It's bigger. Um, and then you need a light sensor or a way of detecting if you've got if, when money falls past and then you can use this to then move a motor so it moves 0.2 rotations back and forward as quickly as can and then you need somewhere storing the pieces above so basically that's how you build this So much for watching this took a lot of time and effort to create and this is actually the second model we had to completely destroy the other model and restart yeah a lot of effort well i hope you enjoyed this brick cat video hopefully there should be quite a lot more of these coming out because i'm now in quarantine so i'm lonely and i have a lot of time to spare 
also should be seeing more cool builds in the future. Well, thank you so much again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making this. And if this video gets, let's say, a thousand views or a hundred or fifty likes, which if one comes first, I'll make a complete tutorial of how to make this. So thank you so much for watching. See you guys later. Bye. -bye.